hey guys welcome to my vlogmas day three and today get ready with me to go take a group yoga class at the gym and also to work out so guys i am running late as you can see this video is a little bit fast forwarded i'm just trying to get my hair a little bit damped you know brush it do a little bit of some lippy and you know just add some brushes like just brush the hair away from my face and just you know get ready to go to the gym uh, it's my i'm a very simple kind of a person you know my dreadlocks really allow me to easily just do things the way i want all i need to do is just hydrate it a little bit put some oil wear my perfume some lip gloss and I'm good. Nothing extra. I'm already dressed, as you can see. I just got my stockings on, got every single thing I needed, and I'm, you know, I'm all good to go. But guys, no earring yet. So guys, I got my earrings and, you know, just got my earrings on. And before you know it, I was all ready to go. And that's it got my bag and hopped on the road guys usually i would take a walk from my house to the street and then you know get on the main road but today i was already running late so i didn't walk i took a bike out of the house and i took this tricycle it's normally we call it keke here and this i was the only one in this keke and this keke driver was giving me some very nice um jazz kind of songs and the trip was really fast so it was almost like this guy knew exactly how fast i needed to be at the gym and before you knew it i got to my next bus stop but the thing is that that bus stop is very busy and i did not want to bring out my phone to start film before they slapped me and collect my phone from my hand so i got into this rickety taxi but at least it's moving and before you know it, I was already at the gym. Usually at the gym, it's traditional for me to stop and greet people, from people's staff to security. So that's what I was doing here. And I had to cut the video short so I could say hi. And here I'm walking into the gym and the receptionist was announcing for people to go join me in my yoga class. I got straight to my yoga class and my my sweet students had already set up and they were waiting for me mind you this was just five minutes before class was supposed to start and guys we just started with some a gentle yoga flow because this thursday my evening classes are usually for beginners so it's beginner friendly and it's very simple and easy we did some stretches and then we got on to doing some kegel exercises which also served as our core exercises and guys, just like that, we had some time where we were, you know, coordinating ourselves, taking a break. And then we had some times when we were back again to, you know, stretches, inhaling, exhaling, and doing some more stretches. So this particular exercise we were doing here was for our core, strengthening the Kegel and pelvic floor exercises. And at the same time, it was also a very good stretch, especially for beginners who don't want to have like, you know, very intense sessions. After that, I went to this simple knee to chest hug. Guys, this was like a one hour session. So these are just like snippets and excerpts from the class, you know, so I could focus and teach class and teach the class because that is my primary goal to share and teach yoga sessions to students and, you know, just really pay attention to beginners, see what they are doing, see where they lack, see where they need assistance and just assist them, twist them, turn them. Just give them all the support that they need, which is basically what I do in these evening sessions. Encourage beginners, be there for them, assist them. So guys, these are just snippets of the class, not like the whole class. So you see the way I run my evening classes and the way I take care of my students. Because guys, my students are top priority. I love working with them. I love teaching them. I enjoy them asking me questions. I enjoy them assisting them and I just enjoy them you know, improving their practice, improving their skills and just, you know, being the best version of themselves when it comes to practicing their own journey into their yoga practice or whether it's for them to practice alone or whether for them to teach other people. So guys, we finished up with those hip openers and now we are at supine twist where we're twisting side to side and getting ready to end practice. 
Before finishing practice, we'd usually practice Happy Baby, which is a hip opener that stretches the back, the hip area, the legs, and a little bit of the neck area. Now, this pose is very good for any level, and it is something we usually practice, you know, to get ready to close to close the session so usually after happy baby we we'll rock side to side and then we're going to get to a point where we're switching off the lights and coming into butterfly at this very point i would give my students a leg rub ask them to put their phones on silent and just for them to chill after the leg rub usually guys i would excuse myself switch off the lights just allow them to be with their thoughts their feelings and to breathe deeply after the leg rub i will usually you know run to the bathroom wash my hands and get ready for my next session so guys the lights are off and it's time for my students to just be here and to chill and you know class is over i go straight to the bathroom i know have like you know ease myself wash my hands and get ready for my own time to work out and you know just focus on myself you know just <laughs> After my fitness coach in introduced the next set of practice, my gym buddy and I, Adiola, we just looked at ourselves and we're like, we're so exhausted, but guys, we just had to finish the whole series. Like, guys, we have done like four, three different sets of, you know, stuff that I couldn't really record because I was tired. Because at this point, I was like, you know what? Me, I cannot come and kill myself, but guys, he was still pushing for us to go for another round of mountain climbers. I don't even know where I got the energy from, but when Davis is in the class with you and he just has, you just have to go. He keeps pushing, 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 and that was how we, you know, got to finish up practice and, you know, just continuously did it because we had to negotiate. We were tired, so we had to negotiate to repeat the um each of the practice like three or four four times just so we can appease him from giving us more intense workout like guys at this point i was just like you know what me i cannot come and kill myself i know they do again i told my body that i won't go again but i ended up doing it <laughs> over and over <laughs> and over again because this guy i don't know whether he came after me and adiola's life and that was it finally he agreed and then we had to finish practice and it was time for us to stretch like guys you won't believe how i was so excited about the stretch usually after david's class i would go and lift weights but guys today i didn't even have the energy to lift anything it was just to stretch out breathe and just you know carry my properties and start going to my heart because guys i was tired but these stretches were really good it eased my leg eased my back you know just stretching out and just you know you know it just being the fact that it's the end of practice was really exciting for me so i give my best to my stretches i did some breathing techniques and you know, Davis was just there to guide us and we just stretched out. Being a yoga teacher, all them stretches are very, very easy for me. But like after working out, it's like even much more, you know, needed because it just has a way of slowing you down and stretching you guys and stretching out the whole body. At this point, we're doing some breathing techniques. And after the breathing techniques, it was time for us to now, you know, hold our breath longer and then it was time for us to go home and i was really 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 so excited and guys before you knew it our session was over and i was getting ready to pack my properties and start going to the house and that's it see me coming to the camera saying i can't keep myself bye so guys i'm taking a moment to look at the gym one more time looking at all the people walking out at this time of the gym i'm like Guys, I'm going home. I'm saying good night to receptionists, to see my fitness instructor, to everybody, see more staff outside, and we usually just greet. And now, guys, I'm going back home with a very, very posh ride because my gym buddy is driving me home, and I don't have to take any rickety, 
um taxi again so guys thank you so much for sticking to the end of this vlog i'm going to see you in my next vlog for now take care bye bye